Even though it's been several weeks since the flooding in central Texas, Lake Travis is still 107% full tonight. Hank Cavaniero shows us how people along Graveyard Point are getting by with some help from others. On a windy day at Graveyard Point, the water from recent flooding is still close to damaged homes. Come in for a second, but honestly, it's uh. This is it. Kim Legrone knows all too Where's well it about the water. It just was full of stuff. You can see it. Come on, I'll show you. This was in there. My drum set. <laughs> Everything from the first two floors of her home is out on the lawn. Even memories from old pictures now share the damage of the 14 feet of flood water. But what do you do? You just let it go and say goodbye and try to say what you can, you know. And it's just been extremely difficult. Yes, I mean, imagine being out of your house for now almost going on three weeks. As for the cleanup efforts, she's getting help. Lakeway Church, Lake Travis Methodist, Hill Country Bible Church, and Oak Hill Methodist. From strangers. And they've just lifted me out of this problem, and I'm so grateful. Did you meet him at the church at nine? Helping to restore a little faith. Anyway, I am, I can hardly wait to look in there. I mean, I, I yeah, just got a glimpse. Yeah, it's, it's really like, nice. <laughs> oh my but, gosh. Because losing her things is still hard. The kindness from strangers is pulling her through. I was going to do it myself. This is the good thing that came from it. Hank Cavanero, KV News.